Hi, my name's Marie and I'm the Deputy Manager of the Small Animal Department at Wood Green Animal Shelters in Cambridgeshire. I'm going to advise you how to care for guinea pigs. First of all, be responsible if you are considering breeding guinea pigs. There are many guinea pigs in rescue shelters, up to several hundred can go into various rescue shelters every single year. Guinea pigs can have anything between one and seven babies. The most comfortable litter is two to three. When you first are caring for the pregnant mums, it's best to keep them in their pairs or their groups. They still need that companionship. During the period that they're pregnant, their diet is really going to need to be boosted. So lots and lots of fresh hay and they should be free to graze on the grass every day. If the weather's really bad, make sure you are picking fresh grass and different types of herbs and wild plants from the garden so that they can really boost their immune system and they're really gaining the weight ready for the babies. And so when you're holding her, making sure you're supporting her completely underneath. The babies appear in two pouches, so she'll often have one to two babies in each pouch. So it's important you are supporting them. Lifting out around the middle can be really uncomfortable for her and for the babies. When you go to lift her, lift her completely like this, so you've got a hand supporting her. Now you'll see they get this dinner plate shape amongst them, and that's as the babies are growing. Nearer towards the end of the pregnancy, you will be able to feel the babies quite solid inside here. And if you're sitting really calm and gentle with the mum, you will actually feel them kicking. Once the guinea pig is preparing for labour, you need to ensure that she's in a really calm and quiet environment. Ensure that she's got lots of food um, available so that she can still feed, although it isn't common for them to sometimes go off their food a little bit an hour or so before they're going to labour. Often you'll find when they are preparing that they will rest themselves lifting up straight, straight against the hutch and that will just make sure that the babies can move comfortably out from her. So she might be readjusting herself. If you ever spot any um, bleeding um, or discharge, make sure you go to the vet straight away as that is not a good sign. Guinea pigs can have troubles with giving birth, so it's important you are responsible and you monitor them regularly. Do regular weighing and regular handling to be able to feel how much the babies are growing. If you feel that the guinea pig um, is having real um, laboured breathing as well and she seems very distressed, possibly doing some discomfort squeaks as well, this is also a course of action you might need to speak to your vets. Once the guinea pig does give birth, she may clean the babies completely but she may then just leave them to settle for a few minutes. She'll give them one short sharp squeak just to tell them to stay still and, and hidden. Baby guinea pigs are fully ready to go. They are mini pigs, their eyes are open, their ears are open and they are ready to feed and go straight away. They will sit calmly and once she's ready she will then call them over and they'll begin feeding from her. During this period, again, make sure you're really filling them up with lots of grass, lots of fresh food and lots of hay. You may need to remove her from her companion if she's feeling a little bit stressed around them. Provide her a large um, storage box or indoor carrier and place her in there with a shelter and the hay and the food so she can just have a relaxed environment. Male guinea pigs should be separated and um, well in advance of the, of the female giving birth as she can become pregnant um, within an hour of giving birth. So it's important that the male is not there again for her to become pregnant again. Baby guinea pigs will also need separating males at around three weeks of age as young females can be pregnant, have been known to be pregnant from the age of around four to five weeks. So please be responsible about your breeding. Most of all, enjoy it. It's a really lovely experience. Make sure she's comfortable, really well fed and be careful with your handling. And that's how to care for a pregnant guinea pig.